Renee's never gonna talk to me again. I will never, ever, ever talk to Renee again. She's got a nasty heart. Tonight on Big Brother, in an extended one-hour edition, Renee and Bianca still feuding after their big blow-up. That argument's never going to be over, ever for me. Alice, sick of being the house mother. I'm not enjoying it anymore. And this week's task... To pass, all they have to do is ignore the obvious. Oh, man, this is hilarious. <laughs> It's the first morning in the house for the three intruders, and the girls are keen to find out what Rihanna thinks of the boys. Can I, can I give you the new girl drill? OK. And it's only purely for my own amusement. <laughs> OK. No, because I, I know what the boys reckon of you, and I want to know what you reckon of them. So OK. Like, oh, like, <laughs> don't we say their names? Oh, I can good. say them quicker than you. OK. You're Benny, the little young... I think he's gorgeous. <laughs> Yeah, I reckon he, I reckon he, he goes all right. Um, Nobby? Oh, Hello. yeah, yeah. No, I really like Nobby. I like Nobby. I think he's a great character. He's very loud. Um, this is probably a good thing that he's stuck in the copy van. Uh, what about Pretty Boy, the new dude? Um, I call him Pretty Boy. I think he has a thing for Bridget. Does he have a thing for Bridget? And you know what? She's like, to she's look like at a bar well. of him. Yeah, she's not that She's like fully look. smitten by a dude on the outside. Yeah. And no guy in here can get even within Oh, arm's that's length cool though, isn't it? That she's, that she's strong like that. So, from Canberra, what do you do? What do I do? In, your, um, in spare time, what do you like doing? Shopping? All my time is spare. So I don't have a job. Yeah, that's sweet. But, um, go shopping, go to uni and meet my friends for lunch. Well, even though you're not at uni, you just go and, like, I just go there the and pick them up. Greet the benefits. I go there and pick them up. Because I'm nice. And I visit my friends in their work lunch breaks. So you're like a fluffer. What's a fluffer? Someone that goes around and just entertains everyone on their lunch break. <laughs> <laughs> and like make sure everyone's ready for everything. Yeah. Oh, look at, look at Cherry hanging out with Bridget all the time. Good. Look at Cherry and Bridget. You can look in there. He's hanging around there like a stain. Who, Terry? Cherry. Oh, Cherry. Cherry oh, yeah. is hanging around oh, yeah. like a stein. Oh, Big stein. Um, Righto, Rawls? I was a bit like, he's really tall, so I was a bit overwhelmed by Rory, but he's a bit tall. But he's lovely, isn't he? Like, he's, yeah. He's, really yeah. Seems to be a bit of a peacekeeper, which is cool. Hey? Sorry. Like Sorry. last Sorry. night, he was nice, like, comforting Sorry. everyone, sort of, and just yeah. welcoming. Are you making cool. bread, Tessa? Yeah, I'm doing it right now. He doesn't act like he looks. Does that make no, sense? No, he's got a massive soft heart. Yeah, yeah. he's a softie. Things are getting interesting. A new chicka in here. Huh? A new chicka in the house. And you got a little chicka chicka like this? I like it. House? Yeah, <laughs> look at your smirk. I like it. You dog. You don't Get what? away from me. Look at you, you smirky. Uh, yeah, it's good. I'm glad. Yeah, of course. Is she? No girls in here. Is she up for fun? Yeah. She's quiet. Nah. She's pretty chirpy then. Cheers. Ah, what's the scene? We'll see. I'm in the right spot. Yeah. Who else is there? No, I do. Travi. Travi. You won't go near Travi. Oh, well, you might enjoy his company, but you wouldn't go there. I quite like the old system. No. 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 I like this, one. no. this one's better. Good for me. The housemates have just nominated for the first time, and Alice has discovered she's up for eviction. What she doesn't know is that Dixie saved her. Yeah, and I'm not going to hide it. I'm not going to walk around saying, oh, it's so great that your housemates voted you out. Like, it's so fun. Because it's You'd not. be scared too, because you were up last week, but so would be. You ain't done so. Well, it's, 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 it's all like, it is the game, and I realise that, but. You know, in life, if you're proactive and you get involved with people, you, you have a really interesting life. You know, whereas I'm up with, you know, someone that nearly slept two weeks. You know, and yeah. it's just, it's just weird. I'm just surprised that 
people don't want me here. You know? Are you working on Bridget, by the way? <clears throat> oh, she seems keen on you, bro. Hey. Hey? Bridget's pretty keen on you. Oh, I'm just cruising, eh? Whatever. Yeah. <laughs> chicks are chicks. Chicks are chicks, hey? Really? But she's a nice chick. Chicks are chicks. Like, she's a nice girl. Really? Prove it. <laughs> Don't give him too much attention, just do whatever you want. Oh, playing the hard to get card now, hey, Terry? Hey, Terry! Oh, playing it hard to get. Oh, he's our man, he knows how to do it. Chicks are chicks. We saw you striking her hair. <laughs> Looking, don't touch my girl, huh? <laughs> Far out, huh? You come in the first day, you start touching my girl. This can. Combi. No, don't worry, do whatever you want to. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you touch my girl, bro? And then, no, don't worry, do whatever you want. We'll have, we'll have Combi Mafia, man, and you have can say whatever you like in Combi Mafia. Combi Mafia. The previous evening, Bianca had a row with Alice and Renee. Renee and Bianca are not speaking, but Alice wants to make up. I'm not saying it's unfair, I'm not saying I'm shocked. Well, I'm so yeah, I'm saying I'm shocked because, you know, look, we had an argument last night, but I haven't changed. Oh, Bianca and I. Yeah. You know, and that's just reality bites. Yeah. So your opinion of me after last night still hasn't changed? No, and that's why I said this morning, like, you're a very valuable person to my time in the house. And we had a heated, like, it was an argument that you have with best mates. It's over in my eyes. You know, it hasn't changed what I think of you or what I thought of you. See, that argument's never going to be over ever for me, not because of that singular thing. It's because that's the argument I have with myself and everybody but else I know every you day do. of my life. And, and it will get here because you feel so passionately about that one facet of yourself. A lot of the reason why I'm here, and everybody knows it, is because I don't like people making assumptions about what people look like and like my whole life is that and I thought wow I really thought that after five or six weeks you'd realize that that conversation wasn't just going to be a conversation to me like it's huge for me and I got so upset but you know from a male's point of view from my point of view breasts you'd be surprised how many people nowadays though that do put such an emphasis on stuff like that I disagree and you I will realize really that when tricky. you're not 18 Coming up, Nobby's Lament. I've just spent six weeks in a leaky combi. Big brother, I am going completely crazy. <laughs> Intruder Cherry is already making his mark. I'm gonna get changed though. Uh... But it seems he's not as popular with the boys as he is with the girls. Oh, do that. He is very cocky. Yeah, like girls are girls. He is very cocky. I told you, man. Yeah. He is the arrogant guy we wanted. Yeah. I'm gonna drill him. I'm bored. At least pick some. Pick one of the intruders for me to drill. Yeah, him. 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 We'll back, we'll, we'll back him up. No, no, no. Yeah, I don't have to back me. I'll... No, oh, we'll, yeah, we'll but I don't particularly go. like him anyway. No, let's just let him go. One on one. I'll just, yeah, I'll just do his head. I did. I got that first impression. I'm married. Had it across his head. A little bit warmer today, and then things like that just make you go. If, if you notice, he doesn't really ask questions about our lives. Like, he only really asks like about people. boasting about his. Yeah. That's Aaron going guy we wanted. Ooh. And may yeah. Oi, we may have even got the Yes. We may have got Dude, close to what we wanted. picked that pretty much closely when I saw the thing and I was like, yep, yeah, she'll be up to fun. Yeah. Yeah, she'll be fun. She's good. I like her. I like her too, yeah. The old dude is going to get annoying now. Mmm, occasional. He'll be like Terry, kind of. Yeah. Oh, you naughty boy. You're a naughty boy. Come on, do your jobs. Do your jobs. Come on. Do your jobs. Do your jobs. <laughs> I think that would suit you. I'll put on the ancient Greek one. No, how is that ancient Greek? Look, have a look at these. Right? Okay, oh, they're not good people to ask. <sighs> Renee doesn't know about that. Here you go, mate. That's... Okay. How are they Greek, Bianca? 
place yeah, than God, Europe. Does this look ancient Greek How or African? How are they Greek? African. African? Ancient oh, Greek or African? Greek. How do you get Greek out What's of that? that? Yeah. Or even almost. Yeah, that's it. Boom, 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 oh, boom. Okay, okay. I admit you're drums. right. That's why you won the second smartest housemate. Exactly. I'm going to try on this wrong. Big brother. Help me. Big brother, I am going completely crazy. You gotta give me some leniency, dude. Like, I can't just stay in that corner over there. I've just stayed there for the last week. It's been raining. My van is leaking and this rain noise is just taking over my head. And like, these new people are coming in, right? And they're all inside. I can't even, I can hardly get to know them. Sure, they come, well, what's, what's his name? Terrence came to the combi for a little bit last night. But like, everyone's going to be inside in the lounge and I'm just going to be sitting in that little stupid corner over there. And like, I don't know how, like, oh, I'm, I'm sure I can handle it, but it's driving me crazy. Bobby. Yes. As soon as there is a break in the rain, Big Brother will issue a challenge for you. Yay. No, thank you. See, that's, that, that made me a little brighter and happier inside. That is all. Good oh boy. Stay. I know it's raining, Munchkin. Good boy! Good boy! Good boy! I was talking to Alice and that's all sweet now. She's just, she always tries to smooth yeah, over, so it's fine, it. whatever. But seriously, I don't even want to look at Renee. Yeah. She just always tries to make everybody feel like they're smaller and they should be afraid of it. Like, you got nothing. Maybe you should talk this out. Don't worry. Say all that door first. In that case, she'll just arc up again with her crazy eyes. At least when I get angry, I'm still the same person. I'm just angry. She's just like. I don't think anyone here is perfect. She's got a nasty heart. I don't think anyone here is perfect. Her heart is nasty. What? Renee's heart is nasty. Hey, Steve. You just woke up, didn't you? I can't sleep probably, but I'm really tired. And I can't oh, sleep this week, otherwise the country will kick me out. Oh God! I don't read into it that much, Bridgie. I really want to leave this week. You don't? I really do. I'm doing a Dixie. Can't we just chuck you forward? Huh? Chuck you forward. Think about that before you go spread the word. No, really. I can't. She wants to go home. Else, eh? I'm gonna. <laughs> can't do it. I love to sing in the rain. <laughs> Hey, big brother, how's things? Is something funny? Nah, I was just reciting a few jokes in my head. Just, nah, nothing out of the normal. Anything you'd like to share with big brother? Did you hear about the two aerials that got married? The uh, wedding was crap, but the reception was great. Next. Alice, feeling the pressure. I'm not the mum in my real world, you know. I'm the jokester.
Tell us. Hi, Rella. I'm having a bad day. I don't know if everyone likes the dog. And I kind of feel like it's me and the dog and everyone else. But I just, I train him. People, people pat him like once or twice and then you have to keep telling them not to do certain things and then you feel like a Nazi mum and you know, it's, I already get called the mum because of my age and it's, I'm not the mum in my real world, you know. I'm the jokester. That was the stress in the world. Oh, mate. I seen her cleaning the bench. She was scrubbing the bench. Yeah? It's like frustration kind of taking it out on the bench. She did not expect it at all, eh? no, I don't know why she wouldn't. She <laughs> She said, um, how are you feeling? She goes, oh, well, pretty <laughs> but, you know, if your housemates don't want you, then they don't want you, yeah, I guess. There's nothing you can do. Just, you know, just suck. Look at her. Same with Bianca. Mm. I think she's hurting a bit as well. Definitely. And that last night just took it one step further. Yeah, just pushed her over the edge, huh? Look at your eye. Yeah, <laughs> it's pretty funny. Are you OK? You're not really, are you? Not really, but it doesn't matter. Are you upset about last night? Um, upset's the wrong word. Angry? Yeah, and disappointed. In housemates, or who are you disappointed in? Well, me, initially, because I shouldn't have been that aggressive and violent. Hmm. And that's what I've been trying to control in here, but there's just no outlets, mm. so you blow up. So that, but disappointed in Renee and Al too, because they, I thought that they were mates, and I, that, uh, they obviously weren't, because if you're a friend of mine, you would know how much that conversation was going to hurt me. I don't feel like I'm flowing with everyone as much as I did. And I don't think I've changed in two weeks personality wise or you know I'm very flat today and I just I just feel I'm gonna be flat tomorrow it's just every day's the same it's driving me out the wall yeah as mates you think you're getting along with want you out like it's you know you can't help but think you know it's not a nice feeling I don't know, I'm sick of hearing responsibility comments like head of house or mum or, you know, I'm just 25, I'm not this. I just, yeah, I'm just, I feel like an oldie and I don't want to. I wouldn't take it, like, personally. Well, you can't say not to take it personally because it was a direct... Renee's never going to talk to me again. I will never, ever, ever talk to Renee again. Mm. But do you think that's... I like... don't want to speak to her. She's a crazy lunatic. You can see it in her eyeballs. Everyone in here loves her to bits. She's, she's got a nasty heart. Mm. She's cruel in the core, man. She's, at least I'm a bitch consistently, really. I can't, when I was I'm... sitting in that room the diary room and I was going off my rocket I just oh I, I couldn't stop thinking about you actually and I just said as soon as Trav comes back that's it no more teasing no more ganging up with everybody else no more even silly joking comments about who you are what you believe in or you know about me about you because I, that is a touchy topic for me about mm -hmm. my breasts mm -hmm. but I was thinking about it it's identical but you cop it every day in a million different forms about who you are, and I was copying it last night about who I was, and I went off my tree, yet you sit there and you're just like, you know, you try and reason and you're this and that. Bigger person than I am, hey, because I would have gone nuts.
Yeah. Man, Rory's putting in the groundwork with the new girl. Oh, yeah, hey. For what? Rory's putting in groundwork with the new girl. Oh, she's yeah. a bit too grown up for Rory, I think. You reckon? She needs someone older. Yeah. You reckon? Oh, yeah. I don't know, hey, she was telling us a couple of stories. Oh, was she? Yeah, she's been with some youngins. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. So you've had no boyfriend, yeah. though. I've had boy, like, yeah, like, well, I've had weeks. boyfriends, yeah. <laughs> two weeks is my Crazy. longest. <laughs> Not nothing serious, so like never. <laughs> it's really sad because I see my sister, like, and she's like in love, and I think that's beautiful. Oh. But I've never been in love. But um, but I don't know. I think it'd be cool. I can't wait. But then and yeah, it's gonna be f***ing and it can be good. For this week's task, housemates must ignore the obvious, and it's getting harder with every Big Brother trick. And anyway, the store manager walks through, and he go and I, I and I, st I was laughing my head off. Yeah. And um, I told, oh, don't, don't ignore it, ignore it, ignore it, ignore it. Anyway, Terry. Yeah, we were talking. <laughs> we were talking. Oh my god. <laughs> Could he be from another planet? And that, and that the. There's nothing going on in the backyard. And yeah. the, yeah. Nothing and at all. I want to get a drink. It was, it was an mm. experiment. <laughs> After the break, take a seat, Terence, and be sure to ignore the obvious. When you enter the diary room, you must always take a seat. Oh, good. OK. Yes, it's all changed. Australia, you now vote to evict. Vote for the person you like the least. And on Sunday, the most unpopular housemate will be booted from the house. To vote to evict this week's nominated housemates, dial 1902 555. And then for Renee at 63, for Terry at 67, for Bianca at 64, for Bridget at 61, or text their name to 191010. Remember, you now vote to evict. Get phoning, Australia. Your votes will decide who leaves this Sunday. The long votes cost 55 cents max. 190 votes from Mobiles Extra. Lines close at 7.45pm Australian Eastern Standard Time this Sunday, the 8th of June. For terms and conditions, go to bigbrother.com.au. Sexy kid. You're so handsome. Oi. I wonder if I could take my guinea pigs to work. I'm going to get Nobby. You're so there's, handsome. There's nothing. Hey, Nobby. <laughs> Come here. Wait, have a look at the kitchen. It's not bad. Quick. What do you reckon of that painting over there? Come here. Quick. What do you reckon of the pot plants over here? Am I allowed to comment? They're what are you talking about? Pot plants? Wow. Do you like those pot plants? I don't know if you really like those pot plants. Oh. They're not bad. Are, are they pretend flowers? No, well, they might be. I think they're really. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if it was yeah. flat, that's how big the pimple was. No joke. It was a full yeah. crazy yeah, yeah, no, no, no. Hey, what else can we feed, Schmuck? Oh, yeah. Hey, look, Alice, we, we made it more. So I have to do the feeding all the time. Yep. We extended it for you, dude. Big Brother's orders, that's cool. What's he going to do if I don't? <clears throat> do you know where I got the idea? Hey? What's he going to do if I don't? I didn't do it this morning. Well, then I just asked someone else to do it. But. Please? I'll do it. I can't do it on my own, Rory. Oh, she needs sorry. help, Rory. You can't feed dogs. A man's I touch. I don't. I can't do it on my own. Yeah, it's segregating me from everyone else, and I don't think segregating. It's not segregating. You need you do. the response. I think it is. It's got a huge part. You got seven minutes, seven times a day, and it's five yeah, it was just. I don't like asking people to do things like Rory. Can we feed it? Ben, can you make sure the water's done? You know, I'm. Just, I, I don't. It's not. 
I don't like being little miss mum and bossy. Come on, dog, let's go eat. Oh! Come on, Ollie. <laughs> Do you want to wrap someone up in foil? Yeah! And turn, it's we don't have any. Why are you doing funny arm oh, movements? Look at that. We can give each other aluminium foil hat. Hey, he'll be all right in half an hour. He'll limp and be sorry. Oh. Wow. This is Alumin Man. <laughs> Yon's mad. I look like the Pope. <laughs> <laughs> This is Big Brother, Alice, to the diary room. Why do you boys get in trouble, man? You get laced to heaps, lately. It's the dog. Passion! Willpower! Prosperity! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Big Brother is concerned that there is a lot of chewing and choking hazards <laughs> for Ollie. Yep. I wasn't watching him before because I was doing weights and I didn't know where he was. If you and a fellow housemate could perhaps survey the house and remove any potential chewing or choking hazards from the ground. Inside and out, the boundaries or just the house? Inside and out. Sure. Can I just put it out there for a one day, a one day thing? What? Have you not, had, to you, has Rory been different to you today? Yeah. In what way? He's just a bit less interested, a bit distant. Especially because I did him a favour, like he said, he pulled me in yet last night and goes, Oi, Al, you got to organise that she sleeps next to me. And I said, yeah, okay, I'll try. Ollie? No. Ollie? Yeah, let's have a game of booby foil. Oh. Booby foil. Mm. Much with that. Oh. I don't like this game for dudes because it gives them a reason to be staring at your boobs. I want to retrieve my ball soon. <laughs> Personally, with his mouth. Yeah. <laughs> oh. I don't like, like, he's been a dick today. Well, yeah, but that. Like, and he was a dick last night. Like, well, you knew, I don't know if I told you, but I told Nobby that. I wasn't comfortable with hugging him, but because I sort of, I, like, I, I don't like hugging normally, yeah, and I felt uncomfortable hugging him. And then he's like, oh, we're not hugging no more. I want to see how I can get with this one. He kind of, he's been big noting in front of her. Mm. And I'm just like, dude, get it off. And like, he even cracked it's the first day. But he, like. even, he even cracked the like, um, Terry came in and he goes, oh, Rory, can you, can you go out? No, he's bored. And he went, oh. God, and got up like it was a hassle. I went, I never thought you'd make Nobby a hassle over a skirt, mm. ever. Mm. He strikes me as a real boys, boys. Mm. Chicks, chicks are a bonus, but boys are boys. Hi, big brother. Terence. Yes, big brother. When you enter the diary room, you must always take a seat. Oh, good. Okay. Thanks, big brother. Oh. That's really good. That went straight through me, didn't it, big brother? I'm not eating that again. Coming up, Intruder Rihanna looking for love.
If I could choose how I planned out my life, it would be yeah, marry my Prince Charming, actually experience love. Dude, she's not it's been nearly 24 hours since Renee and Bianca's blow up, but it's still being talked about. Dude, last no, night, but you'll tell him. She got in a little tiff with Renee, right? Mm. You know I mean? Oh, not with Renee, sorry, Bianca. If, yeah, if he so about First thing this morning, smooth it over. Mm. Renee and Bianca still haven't spoken, man. What That's did she thing. say to oh, yeah. Bianca? She's, um, she said, can we, can we please not do this not talking thing? Because I think. That's immature and petty. Serious. And then try to organise lunch with her and Bianca wouldn't answer. And then Alice will get out of phone. Oh, so Bianca didn't have a bar of it? Oh, she no, said, she said a few words. Talk cool with it, really. oh On Sunday night, intruder Terence arrived with knitting needles and wool for the other old person in the house, Terry. Terry, as you're aware, Big Brother gave you a gift with your knitting. Yes, Big Brother. Do you plan on putting it to good use? I do. I'm going to teach Bridget. She, she wants to knit. She wants to learn. I was going to do it later tonight because I've had a bit of a sleep this afternoon. I was very tired. Had a nana nap. And how are you and Bridget getting along at the moment? Like a house on fire. We have, we have a love-hate relationship, big brother. Yeah, she loves me and I hate her. Ha! Tacos. Tacos. Who's going to make tacos? Tacos. Are you going to make... You can't make can't. it. Alice and uh, Bridget want to. I thought I was, but... What? I thought I was. I thought you'd can the idea, so they owned up to do it. No. Stand by my word. I'll do it. Out in the backyard, Terence launches into another one of his stories. Ben and Nobby are his patient audience. I went uh, across Australia in a panel van in 1974, yep. um, um, before, just before Christmas, maybe in December 21st, 22nd, and the, the road was not sealed from Eucla and the, on the Western border to Sejuna, and we had to drive from 9pm to 6am on an unsealed road to cross the Nullarbor in a panel van. Oh, God. It was classic. Bridget, what would you like Terry to knit you? Um... A pair of underwear. Underwear? Ooh, I don't know if I could do that. I suppose I've got one ball of white wool we might be able to knit a pair of shorts out of. Do you think this will help your friendship at all? Yes. Oh, I could do, big brother. Bridget. Yes? If you could knit Terry something, what would you knit her? Something that goes over her whole head. I'll knit her a paper bag for her head. <laughs> a paper bag? A balaclava. She's charming, isn't she, big brother? Thank you, Terry. Thank, Thank you, Bridget. You. Thank you. That is all. <laughs> I'll start them in, and you can do a few rows of knitting and I'll show you how to do it. Okay. How long will it take? Oh, I don't know that I'm even going to have enough to do it. Yeah, you will. Yay! Trevor's like, oh, who's cooking tacos? I said, oh, Alice and Bridget. And then she goes, I thought I was. I'm sorry, she went nothing. I went, what? She goes, no, I thought I was. I went, mm, you still can. I said, I just, I got, I got the impression you wouldn't want to, so I gave the job to them. She goes, no, I'll stick to what I say. And I went, all right, you can cook tacos on Wednesday. She can cook tacos then. No, you can. I'm you've been the watch. Oi, you're being the watchdog, though. She ain't spruising no. nothing in mine. She put cut up chilies in there on white, and I'm like, <gasps> and my mate had an eight, I think they were an eight track or whatever. That's what they there was CD, well not CD tape deck, whatever. Yeah. And there were two speakers, one here and one there. And I got about two hours sleep between there and Brisbane. Yeah. And you'd be trying to sleep and you'd hear, dun dun dun, dun you know. <laughs> uh, uh, all the way. Every time I hear that song, I think of lying across that. On an, an alibi. <coughs> Terry, you're like 80. I'm like what? <laughs> you're like 80. I'm like 80. I'm about six years younger than her mum, older than her mum. Yeah, but you look like 50. I do not. Yes, you do. In the 
your diary room just now, you said, oh, you don't have many wrinkles, do you? I know you don't, but you still look really old. I don't know how. <laughs> like, my eyes droop and my lips droop, and that's what makes you look older. It's got nothing to do with the wrinkles here, God. I've seen women with heaps of wrinkles who look really pretty and attractive. But they've got heaps more wrinkles than I have. I just need, I just need um, an extreme makeover to rearrange my face a bit. Bit of a little snippy. You got a makeover and it didn't even make a difference. I did so. And the guy says, Are oh, you guys okay? He says, Oh, yeah, all right, what's the matter? He says, I would bust a water pump, you know. Are you okay? You know, your mate's gone in to, to get us another one. And he says, What, what model's your car? And he says, It's an HK. He says, I think. I've got an HK, I think I've got a water pump for an HK holding in the bloody car here, you know? You imagine the mate sitting on, get out of it, we're out in the middle of nowhere, you know? Yeah. And so he comes in the back, gets the, H, the water pump for the H, HK holding and goes over to this guy and says, mate, I've got, a, I've got a water pump here, you can buy it off us if you like. And then imagine that guy just go, you're joking, and then I jump out of the back of the... Uh. <laughs> hey guys! Got him, you guys. <laughs> if I could choose how I planned out my life, it would be yeah, marry my little, mar marry my prince charming, fall completely in love, actually experience love. Have you never had a <laughs> like a long term relationship? No, never. Why do you reckon? Well, I don't know. I think I was talking to Terence today, and he's like, maybe I'm a commit. I'm afraid of commitment, but I don't think I am. I think I'm afraid of committing to the wrong person and getting hurt. So is it usually you who calls it off, or? No, no, absolutely not. It's like always a combination. Um, oh, it's, it, to be honest, it very rarely even gets to the point where we are like boyfriend and girlfriend. It's just like, hey, we just it. cruise along, see how it goes, see how it goes. And for like five years, just keep on seeing how it's going and no. nothing, it, nothing. You don't feel anything, it just ends. That's really sad. Yeah, it is, it is. And I've got all these amazing guy friends, but it's just like, that's it. I just don't. Yeah have any other connection with them. Mm. But then there are guys, like the, two, the last two guys I've dated have been absolutely brilliant and I've cried when I've had to say goodbye to both of them. Like, but the thing is I'm happy, I'm so happy where I love, you know, I love waking up every morning, holding me his hand as we walk down the stairs, like skip to the car and, you know, I love, I love my job. It's, it's not glamorous, it's where I'm a bank teller, it's mainly for homeless people. <laughs> It's what I do, but I love it. I love the people that I work with. I have absolutely... I, the only thing I'm missing is that I have never been in love, I think. Next, Bianca gets a message she can't ignore. <gasps> oh, my God! Uh. Come. Big Brother has given Alice the responsibility of training and caring for Ollie, the seeing eye dog, for his entire stay in the house. She wants to give up the dog thing because she feels like it's segregating her from the Yeah. No, it was That's more like... Yeah, yeah, no, no. The, dog, the dog's not what it is at all. No. How can she feel segregated? Working out, cleaning, all that. She just doesn't come up and talk to him. As part of the ignore the obvious task, Bianca's brother James makes a surprise appearance on one of the plasma screens. When I look at yeah, when I look at stuff. Oh my god! Uh, who is it? What? What? Who is it? We failed the task. It's her brother. Is that your brother? Wait, I mean, Nobby. Look at the plasma. Oh. Oh. Nobby. Look. No. Come look at this. We don't care what you know. So. It's something on the plate. Oh, <laughs> you right? Oh. What? Oh, yes. Their brother right? just popped up on screen. <laughs> and they had a sign that said, I know something you don't know. Who is the girl here? Jenny, my brother's girlfriend. Really? Oh, no. <laughs> so, well, you'll find out soon. And guess what? I don't it's going care to be about present. that. I just miss him, and today is yeah. the day. It's like, is that what you Why brother? today? What's yeah? How can oh. we be expected to ignore that? That's <laughs> yeah. Nah. You can't ignore that. Sorry if I ruined it, but like oh, we ruined it with the foil hats. <laughs> and I didn't bring a picture of him or anything. And like he's a, he's the only person I didn't bring a picture of, so I haven't like seen him or anything. Oh, he was having the conversation yeah. about how much I miss my family and that yeah. I wanted to go this week, and then he comes up on television. Yeah. Oh, it's great. Yeah. I miss you so much. <laughs> maybe, maybe it's not best if you look at people perceiving you as a mum 
Other They're than... calling her a mum. How can she not yeah, say, it's see really it as hard, that? Jovi. Yeah, I can see. I can see that. But like, can you see like that? They've got heaps of respect for you. And everyone listens to you, man. Like, if you say, fair enough. Okay, she's been called a mum because everyone's called her the mum. She, yes, everyone does give her credit and respect, but have a go at her. She's, she's up for norms. Like, I'm not having a shot at you. Like, no, it's, it's so it's cool. it's the reality of this. And this is why I'm not up and in trouble. And I sometimes feel it's intense you can't the last week because of this. The dog. The dog and being head of house, plus he's continued it this week. So I just feel like I'm going around telling people what to do and picking up after people when it's my big brother experience as well, you know, and that's why I said to him, I do not want to see this dog fail, so I will continue to train it, but I am not enjoying it anymore. You know, the playtime for me and Ollie isn't there because I have so many other chores to do that if I then choose to have playtime, I'm having a 24-hour day without interacting with housemates. I'm with a dog. Since the dog, like, everyone's like, you know, we haven't seen her because she's with the dog. And, like, exactly. because there's new people, like, Rory is so sick of the dog now. And you're like, well, you can't be because there's new people. Like, I didn't think Rory, like I said, I didn't think Rory would go so crazy over skirt. Well, he's just simple. He's still just a simple bloke. No, but he struck he he tried to convince us so much that he wasn't like that. And he's turned into the exact dude we said he was. Now. Like I now have had a really day because you think, what's that person saying? You know, and then it's just all come and I'm if if I had done something to you guys, if I was this mega bitch and you could say, Oh stuff her, she deserved you know, I just I'd be happy to go. I don't wanna go but I you know, I just You can't go yet. It's still there. <laughs> Yeah, Ollie's still here. You want to have cold chair still? Yeah, I might have one. I might come, yeah. No. You guys have your cold chair and I'll go to bed. Yeah, I'll, I'll go to bed after. I'll go get our towels. Oh, yeah. All right, then. Thanks. Oh my god! That's so <laughs> Tomorrow on Big Brother, ignore the obvious, producers a red cherry. <laughs> to vote to evict this week's nominated housemates, dial 1902 5555 and then for Renee at 63, for Terry at 67, for Bianca at 64, for Bridget at 61, or text their name to 191010. The long votes cost 55 cents max. 190 votes from Mobiles Extra. Lines close at 7.45 p.m. Australian Eastern Standard Time this Sunday, the 8th of June. For terms and conditions, go to bigbrother.com.au. Want more Big Brother? You can watch 24-7 on bigbrother.com.au or on your three mobile. This program brought to you from Dreamworld, the home of Big Brother.